automatic corners is an effect that is active by default. The icon is in the effects toolbar at the bottom of your screen. This feature reduces the risk of bunched and distorted corners by applying the proper type of corner to different angled objects that are formed in the software. This feature can be applied to applique as well as satin outlines. A fanned corner is a corner where stitches fan around a corner. This corner will be applied to angles that are close to 90 degrees or greater than 90 degrees. A cap corner is formed with an extra segment at the point where the stitching remains parallel to the column. This corner will be chosen for extremely sharp angled corners when auto corners is activated. A mitered corner is a corner formed by two segments that join in a sharp point. This will automatically be formed for corners that are somewhere in between 45 and 90 degrees. In this lower design, when I select it, you'll see that automatic corners is turned off and you can tell that the corners are all banned and the special types of corners are not formed. If I select this design and deactivate automatic corners, you'll see that it will be the same as the object on the lower part of the screen. If you turn underlay off, automatic corners is automatically deactivated. So this is a feature that is usually left on. Here I have a corner and if I select it and zoom in, you'll see that it's a fanned corner. If I go into reshape and click and drag on one of the points, you can see that as I bring the angle sharper, it is going to form a mitered corner. And when I go beyond 45 degrees, it is going to create a capped corner. The corners will automatically adapt when automatic corners is activated.